Just a sec. Bill Collective is basically uh, implementing NGOs. So our idea is to, you know, translate the crazy way of thinking in Europe to the crazy way of thinking in, in Africa. So we are kind of uh, the facilitator in between. It's a big, big, big experience um, for some life-changing experience. But uh, the idea is that uh, at some point we need to find a way that you have, a, you, as you call it in South Africa, an eye-to-eye -eye collaboration. And that implicates that it's not helping. The North is coming to Africa helping. It's more like what kind of platforms, what kind of collaborations and cooperations can you set up to work together. We have uh, NG other NGOs, for example, a school NGO uh, that wants a building. And we have uh, universities in, in Europe that wants to build. So we, we try to be in between and translate this process uh, into possibilities. The whole community is uh, depending, living with that river. Even if we carry their food on your head, when the food, when the river is not, is not full, when we carry the food and then go down to the river, even your leg is shaking because the stone is slippery. Hello. Hello. Basically, it's about connecting this school to a very underprivileged area in South Africa, the Pondoland, the Wild Coast area. There's no roads, no electricity, no water. We are with this school actually on the, on the boundary to Kasulu Natal. Kasulu Natal is the richest uh, province from South Africa. So means uh, there is good health care, there is uh, shopping, uh, there's jobs, there's schools, and uh, this bridge actually serves to connect these two parts. Even 20 k's inside to into the land, there's people that cross that river every day. It's a hike, it's going down the gorge and crossing the river to, to enter and access healthcare, school and work, everything. Mm -hmm. High tide? Yes, yeah. Yeah, it's high. The river is high because of high, uh, rain in, in the back of the country. The river rises and they're blocked off. There's nobody going to school, no teachers can go that side, nobody can go to work. You can't even buy groceries. Uh, actually, we started, a, the community approached us uh, a year ago because uh, three kids drowned in the river while crossing it. So they were very upset and uh, uh, they, they looked for the kids and they found them in, in the sea, um, all three of them dead. And uh, in a very emotional way, the community approached us uh, if we can, as architects and constructors, can provide that bridge. We're falling down sometimes and everything was down, it's mini mill and 
sugar and also the flour was falling down to the river. We can't reach it again. Even, even our body money, even your body is falling, when you're falling down, we have a pain. It's difficult, difficult to our community there to cross the river. Now the community has been waiting for many, many years. They have been approaching government, they have been approaching different stakeholders to get this bridge. Na, wie, wie würden das morgen einmal ausdrucken und nach, äh, wann auch immer wir die Zeit finden, nach äh, Pisana bringen? Und er will vor allem, dass diese Armierungseisen aus dem vorderen Kern rauskommen. We are not contractors, we are implementers, so that means uh, we go to the community, the community approaches us, we want a bridge, then we go back to the community and ask them, yeah, but you're going to help us, because we are not contractors, we can only do that together in a way. So we form a committee and very, uh, that's very important, clarify who got uh, which responsibilities. So they are also carrying responsibility and we are carrying responsibility. So it's a collaboration and that's what's uh, and a collaboration uh, with respect. So basically this week and also a bit next week is pre making a nice working space. Preparation, nice pathways, mixing station, material storage, all these things. Which brings us to the third point, the labor. We've been all never really sorted it out, but now we have to make a plan. We have a lot of meetings and we make decisions together. So there's representatives from both sides of the river, for example, They're in this committee. There is tribal authority, meaning uh, in the chief system uh, representatives, but also then from the political side representatives. There's uh, a male and female members in, in the committee and then we sit and, and discuss about the process and as much because they have knowledge, they have net, a network here, they just are the information flow to the community because you, you can't, who is the community, who, who defines that, but, so it's not us, we are visitors here. But that's why it's very important to work with strong local partners. Then we make another load uh, with bringing the drums, and then we are a little bit up and down, um, yeah, carrying. We had to undergo uh, environmental impact assessment because it's a nature conservation area. Uh, this also goes. Yeah. Uh, we can leave here. We take it to the other side. It's not the architect coming and deciding what to do. The architect is guided by a tradition he finds on that place. He's guided by uh, a climate. It starts with looking at resources. What do you have? What is the setup? You make a process design. What is the most sustainable way to implement a structure? It's like this wall. That's basically the soil from the foundation transformed into a wall by, by a sheer labor force. 
on the technical side, but it's also on the social side. How many community members can you employ? Or do they volunteer? What are the means they can bring in? In a way, we balance a lot. It's a lot of work, project management. And trying alternative routes in the process and at the same time alternative routes in construction. Alternative way of building. Europe in general, labor cost is very expensive and material very cheap, in the comparison at least. Um, in Africa it's different, so the more you save on, on material and the more you invest in labor, the more social the process gets. Okay, down. Okay, same on the other side. Yes, 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 yes. Number one. Woo! Very good. Oh, it's just cool. Okay. okay. I saw because of the rain. Come here, man. Do you still reach the ground? No, yes, no. Man, no man, more. Yeah. Yeah, very good. And they say it's uh, better we drive once with the truck and put, uh, you know, we can put some food and, and the drums and light stuff in the container, but then we have all our things down there, shovels and so on, instead of driving up and down. Well, two people are not going to build the bridge. So how do we find a, create a team for this, for this project? And we teamed up with the University of Applied Science, Carinthia. There's two thesis students that joined in on the planning side. Volunteering engineers from Switzerland that joined in on the technical side. We found kind of a steering committee representing the broader community was set up locally. We also found some engineers uh, that join in also from South Africa. Den sind wir ziemlich genau mittig zwischen die zwei Punkte mit unserem it's mainly the idea to uh, teach architecture through practical experience. So you design something and uh, you build it afterwards. That's my mind. <laughs> Oh, 
We actually do the foundation now. We have a team of, uh, at the moment, 10 community members that are helping us or that we're working together, preparing uh, form work, steel reinforcing, a lot of digging. And in the next uh, three weeks, uh, we're going to do the base of the bridge. Wenn man das einfach so rauf tut, huh? das ganz natürlich lässt und so her. Können wir polieren, ne? Also das hinten Aber das wäre ja das. Wir haben eher Seilwinde. Ja. A mountain climber? No! Of course, a deep sea diver. Mama 
sounds in tune with my body and soul when I space travel. Reason to a peace and the beauty of life unravel. Before my eyes and I'm surprised there's no lies. To be told I don't get old, I just get more and more wise. Advance and get a chance to correct the wrongdoings of people in the past and correctly pursuing an honest goal. But with a dishonest reason for every season, there's a change and for that change a new season. If we're feeding off the knowledge we inherently share, there's no need to know at all, just a need to be aware. Compare me to my expectations, not to a person. I thank God for letting me walk in space. Cause I'm learning and turning as we spin with the earth on its axis. Mind is on the moon while my body's on the mattress. The falling star catches on a trip to planet 10. Reporting back to NASA, I'm losing oxygen cause I'm walking in space. Expert is the title, hit the prison of cosmic harmony. What a story that's like concepts of astronomy. As you're reading it, I'm seeing it and living it with one sixth the gravity with six times your brain capacity. My strategy can be absorbed through satellites. I travel like speed ahead, past your sight to grab the mic. I battle my to the Empyrean and drove them to delirium. Have to work for some, that's what I've learned through my experience. Space is mysterious and magical. Cape Canaveral can't dock my celestial vessel, but natural. Beauty of life can be discovered where I'm stationed. Preoccupied with Martian life and halting space invasions. Blazing through atmospheres, and I will be removing you. If you're a disruption, then I'm setting foot on Jupiter. Got the plans to follow us on a hike Through the stars with a mic and turntable we strike If you're not dead yet, then you're considered a recruit So check your headset and zip up your space suit Your star struck like Ptolemy I have colonies who follow me Searching for a meaning that they think is mind-boggling and startling But it's not all in me what they're stalking So go ahead and grab your moon boots and your walk What about the beach day? Oh, beach day. Beach oh, day. Tomorrow, eh? Beach and beer day. Mm. No, but you have a star. Thank you. 
up. So I think it's, it's for the community as a, as a whole, it's an amazing project. I'm also appreciative that they trust in us that we can actually do it in this way. It's a different way. So I think that's also always in, in creating these partnerships for everybody to realize it is not an ordinary construction. It is not there's the developer and there's the money and chuck and there it happens and you just passively lean back and wait until it's there. No, you actually be part of it in doing it, in creating it. <laughs> 